everyone. I have another product review um, and breakdown for us today. This is the Simple Stories Collector's Essential Kit in uh, the collection Happy Trails. So this is going to be outdoorsy, campy um, stuff. And it's kind of got this like 50s vibe to me. It looks like if you ever watched I Dream of Jeannie and like the cartoon um, intro that they had, it reminds me of that art. So um, I thought that was super cute. So let's start with the paper. This is all the paper for this kit. I didn't um, buy any separates. I just bought the entire kit. So this is the first one. This is called Happy Camper. It's even got like some boats and stuff in there. So if you um, were a, a boater or a fisher, that could work. And this is the back. This almost looks like a photograph to me. I think it might be. It's like a, a stump. Okay, this one's cool. This is a, a nice floral, but it's with colors that you might not often see. Um, you know, like no pinks, no purples. This is a, like a mustard yellow, um, a peachy orange, and then you got like red berries here. And then this really pretty light blue. So I love that this is included because it will go with the colors and the theme, but it's an easy like background or accent piece. And this really pretty peachy orange on the back that matches this flower color perfectly. And a plaid, which I love, love plaids. So useful. And this is so fun. Look at this. This is not what I would have thought to have included. This almost looks like a koi pond to me. so like Japanese looking. But you could definitely use it um, for like fishing. Okay, this is like a picnic to me. This checkered theme. And it's, if you can see there, not the darkest red. But the other one is actually um, like a polka dotted red. So from a distance it makes it look just like a little bit paler but it's actually a, a small polka dot. And then another wood grain. This is one of those nice versatile wood grains that doesn't look um, too fake. And this one's super fun. I love that this has canoes or kayaks on the top. These are probably canoes. So I like to kayak a lot. So I think I can make that work for that. You know, on the way to where you're going though, this would be a perfect um, accent page for that. And then this is fun. I love maps and I also love this color green. So this looks like it's centered around Yellowstone. Yeah, it says Absaroka. I'm probably saying that wrong. First called Yellowstone Range. So you could definitely, I'm weird about using maps that are actually where I'm at. But this is one that I think is subtle enough where you could probably just use it as a background. This is another really cute one. Like these little like lake cabins and then a tent on the lake here. Like a mountain cabin. So you could you could cut these out if you want to. You could fussy cut out um, what you want, depending on, you know, whether you're on the water or in the mountains. But this is also just super easy to use as a whole page. And then on the back, this is a floral. Let's get to focus there. A really subtle floral. This matches that other floral in design, if you notice. But this is just a solid color with a slightly paler green um, for the design. So very subtle, but adds a little bit something extra to the page. And this I thought was fun. These actually have like little cut lines around them. So you could use this as a whole page and use this kind of like as a design feature, or you could, you know, cut out right along the lines if you wanted to and have these as little embellishments. But lots of fun things for you to cut out depending on what your, your type of camping and outdoor experience is. <laughs> Here, my cat. Oh, and our favorite, mosquitoes. Mm. Don't like these guys, but it is often something that you run into while camping. A really pretty page too. I love 
love trees and I love that they combined all the different colors in this theme into these trees. So that way you can use it with literally any paper in this pack and it'll blend in perfectly. And then on the back, this is awesome. This is like hiking boot prints and it looks like some deer tracks and bear tracks. I don't know what those smaller paw prints would be. Apparently my cat really likes this one. She's meowing at it. Okay, so that's awesome. I definitely would use that. And then I love cut aparts that are two by two. So this is a two by two cut apart. And look at these awesome like people. So this is what I was talking about like with this kind of um, drawing style that looks almost like I Dream of Jeannie, if you know what I mean. But these are fantastic. I will use these for sure. super pretty cross stitched and this is the back so this is like that typical I don't know um, what you call these kind of people designs but you would see them on signs so it could be like a you know hiking sign or oh, who you know who doesn't see a roast hot dog sign but <laughs> that's adorable so this is that same um, stump background it's just got these little people you know, print on top of it. Okay, and here it looks like a three by four cut apart. So you can see this one here, adventure starts where plans end. Live, love, explore. Some more fun. That's cute. I like how that has a little journaling box in it too. And this is a fun thing. I've often heard people say, I have trouble journaling sometimes. And so I've heard that it's a good um, idea to just do like the, you know, who, what, where, when, how, why type questions and, and go from there. So that is actually like built into that for you for to help you appropriately journal. It says, holy mackerel, don't moose with me instead of don't mess with me. Searching for clear skies and fresh air trail this way. That's cute. On an adventure back soon. Explore. That's fun. I like this camping permit or campground permit as a type of journal option. Happy camper and this girl with a little bird. And the back is a navy blue with speckles and stars, so like a night sky. Okay, and here we have a 4x4 four four cut apart. Hook, line, and sinker. Camp Mosquito. Ooh, I do not want to go there. It says adventure is in our blood. Ooh. Let's go with the canoe on top. Let's get our flannel on. Let's go outside. There's those flowers again. Let's take a hike with a backpack on. That's fun. And then Born to Wonder. Ooh, and then here's just some pretty clouds on that same light blue that you've seen throughout this collection. Okay, and here's some four by six cut aparts. Life is a beautiful adventure. Live, love, explore. I like those lanterns. It's just a, you can use it as a journaling box or put a photo in there if you wanted to. Happy trails. This one says chasing beautiful views. And this is lake rules, relax, read, smile, swim, dive in. I could totally see using that. And on the back, this is the same um, pattern as that one that had those cutout lines on it, but this is more monochromatic and doesn't have the little cutout lines. Okay. So also in this um, came this 12 by 12 sticker page. So I'll go over these. Oh, you got another little mosquito. I do like when they put these little bitty stickers though, because often on a busy page, I want to add like a little something but I don't want to have a big sticker. And so whenever they have little stickers like this, it makes it easy to add that in. And this is all one piece with these lanterns on a string. That's fun. Oh, look at that adorable raccoon. Roasting marshmallows. This 
that bear again. There's one of those fish. I'm gonna assume this is a trout because it looks like they have flies for flies fishing. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with trout. <laughs> Get real. That's funny. And then words. Definitely love when they have words. Okay, so this is one whole sticker. So it's rise with the sun, enjoy nature, breathe fresh air, swim in the lake, under the stars. But then down here, we have a bunch of separate words. So these are all individual, you can pull them out separately from one another. I love these, I will use these for sure. And these little tabs also. And then at the very bottom you have a border sticker and this is beautiful, I love this border sticker. Another thing that came in this set is this collection of chipboard stickers. And some of these are similar to the flat stickers you can see here. They have these lanterns on the string. Some of them the same. I like this take a hike one. Into the woods, field notes. I that camper. And finally, we have the um, ephemera pack, which they call it the journal bits and pieces, 49 pieces. Here's a quick snippet on the back. Okay, we got some really little guys. That says trees. We got a fly for fly fishing. So get that in the light for you. Campground. Picnic site. I got some of these guys here that were on some of that paper. Oops. Let's get another little one. It says woods. Critters. It says uh, trail. Tent, cabin, and hike. Okay, we have a few blank ones that would be easy for like a caption or a photo. We have a lake sign, some more circles, a campfire, a hiking boot, and an enamel mug. Okay, and we have fresh air, trailhead, viewpoint, off-road, camping, exploring, swimming, hiking and fishing. Another one of these little guys, this one says explore. And we have gone fishing, take a hike, Tackle that'll make the fish bite. This is a fun one. It looks very like antique like. This is a blank little card. Moosing around journaling card. Happy camper. I love the cabin. I love how this looks like it's an embroidered design. That's super pretty. Trail sign. Live, love, explore. Home is where your tent is. That's fun. Go jump in a lake. That'd be great if you had a picture of like one of your kids or a family member, you know, leaping into the lake. Please don't feed the wildlife and the mosquito. <laughs> okay, turn left on Highway 94. That's cute. Don't feed the bears. That's appropriate. We live really close to the Smoky Mountains. So this is appropriate for where we live. And one of those campground permits. I like that. Lake rules. This was also, we saw this earlier on a cut apart. Let's go outside and like a, it looks like a photo. Adventure awaits. Well, that's interesting. Oh, adventures await. I was going to say that doesn't make sense. Okay. And then happy trails. So that's awesome. I love this one. Okay. So there's all the ephemera. You can see it all. And I absolutely adore this collection. I got this, and I believe they still have it um, 
on Joanne's web, uh, the website for Joanne, and I believe it was on a decent sale. So if you are looking for something like this, I would go check there um, and see if you can get it on sale. So thanks for watching. Thank you.